Yo guys, what's up? Vamio Bro here with a new video for you guys and today we are going to be doing a PvP video. That's right, another PvP video on Randy Starring Knife. Dudes, I did the grind for this weapon. I did the freaking grind for this weapon and I finally got it. It would be a freaking shame for me not to use this weapon in a video, right? So the loadout is going to be Randy Starring Knife, the big boy. Uh, the Recluse, not really. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to go for Gnawing Hunger on that one. Doesn't really matter what your secondary is because I'm going to be using Randy Soaring Knife all throughout the game. I'm going to try using Zen Moment and Snapshot Sights because they both feel like very PvP uh, perks ish. And obviously, if you're going to go PvE, Rabbit Hit would be really nice to get those fast reloads. And Kill Clip would be really nice to always get that uh, damage buff. Easily going to get that damage buff in uh, PvE. After we jump into some games and I get like a good feel for the gun, I'm going to give you guys my pros and cons about this gun. I'm going to give you guys like my two cents on this gun while I was using it in this video. All right, let's go. Meltdown, this one has a lot of long angles. Like half the map is just like a long angle that I can hold with Randy's throwing knife. So I'm pretty excited. Let me claim zone A, there he is. Look at the range I got on him, look at that. Boom, but I didn't kill him though, that's weird. Oh, 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 vigilance wing. Boom, 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 boom. Look at that. I couldn't get my headshots in there. It's too far. I just like hold this angle right here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get this uh, heavy ammo right here. Oh, wait. No, somebody got, somebody else got it. He's doing the same thing. He's just... <laughs> the dude was just like waiting there for me to move up. Hey, 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 hey. No, no, not today. Not today. Okay, they should be spawning at C now. Somebody's definitely gonna peek here. Definitely gonna find somebody here. Uh, got somebody though. Okay, defending A is my best bet right here. Yeah, they didn't even see me. You see, having a standoff here, like trying to see who can hold their lanes better. What up? Was that is that symmetry? Are you using symmetry? I feel like he was using symmetry. I beat him with it. No, well, it wasn't shooting at me directly, but hey, 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 hey. Let's go. Wait. Get out of here. Alright, take B. Ooh, got him there. Yeah, I can hear symmetry in the distance. Ah, uh, much better. I like that. Uh, yeah, he got me with symmetry. Now, the reason why I choose, if ever, I choose symmetry over Randy's Sword Knife is because symmetry has the alternate fire mode where uh you can shoot like tracking projectiles that just deal way more damage not today green arm for life did somebody cast the spectral blades dude get out of here with your symmetry man oh gosh oh gosh got him what are you doing what are you doing oh gosh 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 yeah, get out of here. Oh, did I get him though? Okay, wait. Oh, oh, these are enemies. Okay, got him. No, hands off my zone. Get out of here. You see this? The way I can hold this zone, uh, this this lane? It's insane, man. Zone a lost. Ah, I lost it though. Freaking insane. Oh man, the headshot damage. Imagine if I had kill clip on. All right, come on, symmetry versus uh, Randy's. Let's go. Prove to me that yours is the okay. Oh, he was using the alternate fire. Zone B lost. Ooh, gnawing hunger is also really good. I got Zen moment for this as well. Ooh, got him. Boom! 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 Uh, 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 oh gosh, Waking Vigil. I don't know that gun. I'm just randomly calling out the names of the guns that they used to kill me, even though I don't know them. What if I actually used my super? Would I be a better player? Two for one. Strength in numbers, Guardian. Excellent. Get out of here. All right, pretty nice. 
Pretty nice. Oh, it ran out. <laughs> yeah, they have the advantage for way too long there, and now they're really far away from us. Uh, I don't think we can win this. If we can just like hold everything until the end, yeah, I guess we could try and win this. Yeah, but if uh, oh wait, I thought that was an enemy. How did I win that? How did I win that? Where is he? Where is he going to go? Lols! I'm going to catch some of these dudes. Hello there. Why hello there. Green arm for law. Oh gosh. Get out of here. Two for one. Bro. From this loss, if we had a little bit more again. time, we would have won that. Enemy claimed zone Ooh, B. look at the effective range, man. Okay, if I... Uh, boom, I got kill clip. Let's push. Ooh, it's good. Okay, push. Got kill clip. Good. Okay, okay, okay. Not, not a good. Oh, we had Cerberus plus one. I want to make a video on Cerberus plus one, man, because that is nowhere in the meta. I gotta admit, though, I think I like using Zen Moment more uh, than Kill Clip. Gives me the extra accuracy on the precision shots there. Uh, for the for the precision shots. Ooh, okay. Let me reload. Kill clip, kill Zone clips up. Lost. Nobody's there. No, that's a, that's a problem there. Uh! I, 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 that's why I'm thinking kill clip is more of a uh, PVE weapon, uh, PVE trait, rather than just PVP. Oh, but as you can see, with the kill clip, does a lot of more damage. With oh man, all these guys just dropping like flies, bro. Oh gosh, gosh. Okay. The accuracy, bro, is just way too good. Ooh, got him there. Cool, cool. Uh, might want to do a super while we have advantage here. Hello. Yeah, he's down. Ooh. What? Ooh, ooh. You can't get me. Lol. Uh, almost got him. I think rapid hit with kill clip would be better because like the more the more precision shots we get we can like reload faster, right? Therefore getting kill clip much faster. They get the heavy ammo. Oh, I can't Hey you see that? You see that? Oh, this is the perfect range, man. Oh! I thought it was going for somebody else and not me. Yeah, it took us a while to get a zone. But yeah, it's the typical, you're third, you're gonna win. But you're not surprised. What the heck? That was a point blank with a hard shot. Didn't even hit me directly. Yeah, we are so losing this. Yeah, 10 seconds is way too long. Zone C lost. Rise from this loss and fight again. Woo! Having a lot of fun with this weapon, man. Not knowing hunger, not knowing hunger. <laughs> uh, Randy's throwing knife, man. Really great. Breakfast. Analysis time. Pros and cons of the Randy's throwing knife. Now, obviously, great freaking gun. Uh, impact is a little bit on the low side. You're not going to be dealing a lot of damage. Uh, it doesn't hit as hard as Jade Rabbit, where Jade Rabbit can, I think, 3-tap, or maybe 2-body tap, and then 1-head tap. But, it sure as hell can't shoot as fast as Randy Story Knife. Now, this freaking gun, I have to say, it makes holding angles so easy. I want to say it's worth the grind, but the thing is, when you have <coughs> Master Rahul, when you have Master Rahul just selling Symmetry right there in the tower, I'm pretty sure you want to go with that instead of using Randy's throwing knife or grinding for it in general. Pros of the weapon is obviously extremely fast fire rate and you can see, as you can see the snapshot sights and the Zen moment, perfect for PvP for getting those uh, sick headshots in. But again, the biggest con of this weapon is the reload speed and the fact that it doesn't deal as much damage as some of the scout rifles. But it doesn't matter because the rate of fire compensates for that. I'd say the biggest thing that would separate Randy's throwing knife from other scout rifles is the fact that you can push 
with this weapon. The fact that you can push with this weapon and it's a scout rifle. Again, is it worth the grind? Probably. If you're a person who really likes to grind for stuff, go ahead, go get it. It's a worth it gun. But again, if you're just looking for a good auto rifle to use, probably symmetry is better. I think I've talked about all the pros and cons that I could think about uh, with this weapon. It's a really nice weapon and rightfully so because it is a pinnacle weapon. This gun is going to be sunsetted though, so it's not going to be able to be used for PvE when the new expansion comes out. But like, right now, as it is, like with the current season, it's just a beast. It's a beast in PvP and I'd love to use this every single time. But alas, we have to make other videos and that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, please do like and subscribe. If you guys want to watch me live, you can uh, check the description box below for the Twitch link. I go live every Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, 8 a.m. Philippines time. If you guys want to play with me, give me a chat. And uh, if you guys want to ask me anything, put it down in the comment sections below. Tell me your thoughts on Randy's throwing knife. Is it worth the grind or not for you? Tell me your experience with it. I'll be waiting for your answers. And thank you so much. I love you guys so much. I'm out. Peace. I'll see you in the next one.